and welcome to Girl Talk. Ooh, so excited today. <laughs> we are here at Stonewash. It's my favorite place ever for inspiration. And I have three inspiring women here joining me today. Kim Ford, thank you so much for You're joining so us. You're welcome. You've worked here at Stonewash how many years? Eleven and a half years. Have you really? Yes. And good friend, Susan Wood, good to mm -hmm. see you too. I'm Pleasure. really excited to meet you. I've heard absolutely crazy, am amazing things. So, Miss Susan Miller, you are an independent designer. Talk to me a little bit about what you do. Um, well, Debbie, I've been working here in the Hilton Head area for about 15 years. Mm -hmm. And I specialize in whole house renovation and in custom high-end design and new construction. Mm -hmm. um, so my um, inspiration is my client. Um, Miss Rhonda, we hadn't even introduced you yet. <laughs> That's very oh, sad. Robinson. Good to see you. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming today. We actually had fun meeting before. So tell us a little bit more about your collaboration. Uh, well, Rhonda and I collaborated on a beautiful renovation of her Hampton Hall residence uh, this past spring where we redesigned her existing kitchen space and created a custom area uh, where she could entertain and enjoy her family and where she could bring the outdoors in uh, to her home. Why? What were your thoughts? Did, were you just moving, new, renovation, mm -hmm. ready? Retiring to the area and wanted a nice kitchen to entertain and and have all the designs that, that we wanted and Susan and Kim helped bring that <laughs> it's together. It's fun to have people captive. Mm -hmm. Did you kind of pull um, photos from House or Pinterest or whatever? Did you see in your mind and then yes. Susan was the interpreter? Did you guys all kind of talk together? How did it all come together? Well, Susan sent some inspirational photos. There and, you go. <laughs> and that, uh, <laughs> that sort of got the ball rolling and okay. then brought me to Stoneworks where Kim mm -hmm. and Susan and I and my husband went through and picked the right piece. And, and Kim, how do you start this process? I guess I should throw it both to you and Susan. How mm -hmm. do you all start this process? Because I think for a lot of people, mm -hmm. it can be really intimidating. It's like, yes. I don't even know where to start. Well, it was a little bit challenging for me because uh, Rhonda and her husband, Monty, were still living in the uh, Northern Virginia area that had not relocated yet oh. and their uh, realtor is a former client of mine he recommended that Rhonda contact me so we initially worked over the phone we mm -hmm. had several sessions yeah. where we emailed inspiration mm -hmm. pictures initially that's nice that's and where nice. Rhonda and Monty gave feedback and then uh, provided some own inspiration ideas of their own so I was able to really uh, kind of lasso what their vision was for the home even though they had yet to move in or yet to even close on the sure. property. So we worked together long distance and then once they closed on the property, we met on site and really just reaffirmed um, the design direction that we had come, that we had come up with mm -hmm. and uh, pulled the trigger. Well, let me ask you both, you two, a question mm -hmm. specifically. When you're selecting hardscapes or surfaces like that, what are questions that you ask your clients that are important to the selections that you all make? Well, definitely their color theme or palette. Okay. Okay. Susan's always got that pretty much under wrap by the time she comes to select the top mm -hmm. or tile or what have you. Um, has talked with the client. They have a cabinet color, okay. so that's important. So we know that and know the feel that they want to go with. Now, you work a lot with the cabinet company, too, so that's a nice collaboration. Share a little bit about that. Yes, I'm currently affiliated with Marcraft Cabinets. Mm -hmm. uh, we are a new supplier in this area. We have a beautiful showroom that will be opening uh, this fall. Uh, across from Mox Creek. Across from Mox Creek in Bluffton, <laughs> so um, please stop by and visit us. But we do have the luxury of offering several different product lines and an assortment of um, displays mm -hmm. so that customers can get ideas and can be inspired. Well, and you all said that you're gonna put some things in each other's showroom, so <clears throat> there's nothing better than being able to have mm -hmm. my cabinet, mm -hmm. see a cabinet design and color mm -hmm. with stone. It really, I think that's just yeah. absolutely We're gonna brilliant. be doing the beautiful kitchen there as well as their um, reception desk in the entry. Oh, are you? Oh, that'll be so fun to go see. We're gonna take a really fast break okay. and come back and talk a little bit more about your house and some of the things that you all as professionals are seeing that are really trending in the industry. Stay with us, there's more to come on Girl Talk. <laughs> 